One thing that a lot of folks are doing out here, it's Las Vegas, baby. They're gambling, and sports betting is huge. KSHB 41 Sports Director Mick Schaefer actually went to go talk to some of the experts about it, and you may want to bet, just not in Vegas? Exactly, Dia. You know, sports betting is a hot topic in Kansas and Missouri, maybe a hotter topic in one state over the other right now. But of course, we're in the mecca of sports betting right here in Las Vegas, Nevada, even though you can do it in more and more places now. Uh, the first round to me has become very big. Welcome to Las Vegas, but take your NFL draft bets elsewhere. It, it is ironic that the draft is here, and yet in terms of a betting aspect, it's, it's going to be very fleet in terms of what you can actually get. John Von Tobel is a host for VSIN, a sports betting network in Vegas. And because the draft is here, to counter any leaked information, prop bets are taken down 24 hours before the draft. So uh, the people all coming into town that they're going to get here, when they get to Thursday, uh, there's going to be nothing available. And in fact, at 5 p.m. Pacific time on Wednesday, nothing's going to be available. And that's okay, since nowadays over 30 states have legalized sports betting of some kind, with Kansas possibly becoming the next, meaning Nevada now has competition. Just the amount of money that's been wagered by state, Nevada's now fourth at essentially $1.9 billion for the year 2022. For all those years, right, it was only Nevada who, who was tracking this, so uh, that's definitely changed things. Take the odds on Vegas still surviving, though. There's still a certain appeal to Nevada and Las Vegas that I think a lot of people will still come out here, but I don't think that sports betting is at the top of the list now for a lot of people that are coming out here. After all, the NFL planned a trip here and even grew some roots in Vegas. All of a sudden, you know, they realized what has always been true, like, oh, like it's regulated sports betting. There's, there's not, like, CD mobsters on every single corner trying to fix things. By the way, the new king of sports betting in the United States is New Jersey. Almost $11 billion wagered on sports in that state in 2021. Dia.